guys we are once again back with some more harvest moon hero of leaf valley and i'm actually very very excited because we have less than a week to go until summertime and it is the new season new beginning for us actually as usual first things first what we're gonna do is just go ahead and check the weather for today okay tomorrow should be sunny yay which is great because i really want to plant some things as well and another good news is that our dog has already we already have like a one heart with our dog so that's great you know all all of our feeding and you know like training him has definitely been paying off i'm just gonna go ahead and give him uh yeah let's let's be stingy for today actually let's give him the clam and see if we can now we can't put it in let's actually just go ahead and give him uh a green herb and there's a ton of things in our inventory now so it takes a while for me to um go through all of it which is great you know it means that we're finally achieving something and it's great to know that we've achieved quite a bit of stuff even even though it's like just the first like eighth of the game because you guys there's gonna be four uh I think there's overall there's probably gonna be eight seasons that we're gonna experience so basically two cycles of each season for the main storyline plus an additional year after the main storyline which we can do as kind of a free play and all that stuff so it's 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 very very exciting actually let's go ahead and train our dog really quickly grab our ocarina and let me just grab my notebook here it may take a second because i usually close it if i'm not recording and it takes me forever to find like my notes on instructions okay there we go okay so as usual let's go ahead and train him how to sit and then how to stay really doesn't do anything uh and come uh, what's this next interaction? A uh, search, which is the most important one in my opinion. Let's do that a bunch more times. And then pursue, which is one that I could never seem to make it work. Jump. And then finally we have beg. Oh, My parents always taught, actually my mom taught me this especially, to not make animals beg. Like, not, you know, um not make them work I'm, I'm not sure how you how you describe it but don't like hang or dangle food in front of them because that's kind of cruel and mean so my mom is really really caring about when it comes to animals like she did i don't know just a bit of trivia i guess she does not want to watch like discovery channel or national geographic because she can't stand watching animals be eaten by other animals like every time we watch like Ge National Geographic or Discovery Channel and like a lion eats like a gazelle or something she's like oh my god I hate life she I don't know she that's that's my mom for you guys but I think I, I inherited she I got my whole squeamishness from her because I'm, I'm scared of a lot of things blood included like when I was younger I was mentally prepared to be a doctor but I mean, I'm, I'm, I have a fear of blood, I, like, so I'm really scared. Anyway, uh, moving on with the actual LP, let's go ahead and check and see our animals. Okay, doesn't look like they have any problems at all. So uh, eventually, we're gonna get like better quality eggs, in particular, golden eggs from the chicken. I'm very, very excited to see that. Uh, so golden eggs are a thing in Harvest Moon, actually. It doesn't... You know it it has you know um even in other console versions like a wonderful life you can also have some golden eggs as well so that's actually quite exciting and we can also milk our cow hopefully she's doing fine we are getting quite a couple of sunny days uh, so I do want to go ahead and plant our last batch of crops for the season uh, okay, let's go ahead and brush strawberry. So I'm, I think I'm gonna put off buying a cow yet because I want to. Uh, where is the milker? There we go. Oopsie, wrong tool. Uh, I want to um, as much as possible and as soon as possible. I want to purchase 
an upgrade like uh, not an upgrade but i want to purchase like a legit why is the chicken all the way here outside like girl go back to your chicken coop but yeah like i was saying i really want to buy a dog house because i don't want to keep our dog outside in the elements and stuff but before we go do anything let's go ahead and actually do our rounds feels like it's been forever since we've stopped by and actually just talked to people and stuff like that so let's hurry up and pass by lila's shop really quickly so we can um give her something and also ooh, we have a bunch of red herbs awesome let's not say hi to the, the harvest sprites because i don't have anything to say to them anyway uh so yeah if you guys remember in the last couple of parts we experienced the horse race which was very very exciting we won a couple of medals and then the the last part before this one we just took it easy you know we didn't do anything too too crazy but i like taking it easy once in a while normally i would not inc include probably you know because i did watch let's plays of this game and usually people don't bother to include like days when they're just idle and not farming and stuff but personally i did want to include in my these days in my episodes because i don't know it's just so you guys can keep track i do plan to include every day so we have about 120 days in one year so we have to multiply that per by three and that gives you guys an idea of how many episodes this lp is gonna last okay let's go ahead and buy some carrot seeds are very very productive apparently they sell for like a hundred per piece in um in the villa so i do want to plant a lot of these like a lot uh 12 would be great um and then let's go ahead and buy some four potatoes as well or maybe six yeah, let's go ahead and buy six potatoes okay and as usual we used up most of our money so that's really depressing but really we really need to just save up as much as we can because i think it's also a good investment if you imagine we have 12 carrots one of them each one of them are gonna sell for a hundred per piece at the villa so that gives us 1200 in one sitting so or like in one go let's go ahead and talk to bob here another nice day today okay bob just wanted to let you know that there are times when we may be out of our products and let's work part-time uh yep this is probably the last couple of parts that we're gonna work part-time for him because eventually we're not gonna work part-time at all because we're gonna be too busy doing other things but actually let's go ahead and chat with winter here if you guys remember in the last part we did take care of her and only her <laughs> like we literally ignored everybody else in this farm how sad uh and let's make sure to milk the cow as well uh okay because i do want to take that milk with me as well <laughs> you know milk really really good source of income even though i've never sold any milk at all it's actually really interesting usually mo most often than not i would i would spend uh or i would use like i would you know milk would be my main source of income if every time i play harvest moon but now i see more use in it as like an ingredient or as food for our dog because it's very very important that you build a relationship with your dog because your dog is going to be your only way of finding power berries and i know i've mentioned this a lot in the previous episodes but if you guys don't know what power berries are power berries actually expand your health so it, it gives you more health it gives you more strength and it gives you more stamina which means that you can pretty much work longer and i think there's a total of four uh for like berries power berries so you know you can actually pretty much increase your health bars uh four times so that's great we can do a lot of more stuff especially as we move on to year two when it's mostly gonna be us farming and i did look up cut the cutscene and the events and yeah there's not gonna be any more events up until no not not 
entirely nothing but most of the events are concentrated on spring and winter time i noticed so the next couple of events that we're experiencing are probably gonna be towards the beginning of summer okay 200g and awesome yeah pretty much on the only reason why i'm working for bob in the first place is so that i can oh it's already one oh my goodness i really need to pick up the pace and uh go ahead and give him an egg I really need to pick up the pace and work at the lumber area. And then I'm not even sure if I can offer something to the goddess, but it is a Wednesday, so I don't I don't know. We might have some time. I don't I think we're not going to stop by at the villa today. Let's just go ahead and say hi to them tomorrow instead. Uh, but yeah, I just really want to work part-time for Woody because I want to unlock that lumber place myself. We need to have like, how many lumber do we have? Uh, I think we have eight. Yeah, we have eight pieces of lumber. And yeah, we just need to get as much as we can. Actually, we need to have 10 at least and also have 3000 gold, which is quite a feat if I do say so myself, but anyway. And eventually we're gonna unlock the mine for our own personal use so yeah it's 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 great you know it, it does involve a lot of hard work uh -huh, you need something uh did you know that daily routine is important yep let's go ahead and give him one of our red herbs once again oh thanks this is good for you when you're tight and let's go ahead and work part-time okay yep Please take us to the Woody place. Woody place, lol. Because his name's Woody. You see what I did there, you guys? Okay, this is the spot. When you're ahead of the game. Okay. Ah, I, as I said before, you cut the trees down here with an axe and gather all the lumber. Use the axe that we give you. We've hired you to do this job. We don't expect you to use your own axe. You'll get paid for the amount of lumber you actually collect. So good luck. I'm gonna go ahead and collect uh, some truffles. Is this even a truffle? It doesn't look like one. Baby truffle. Oh. Could probably eat that and help us a little bit with our performance. I'm not so sure if it's gonna let me eat it though. Oh gosh, I should have eaten like some truffles before going here go ahead and cut this tree and you guys can see that we're losing so much strength by using this axe so quite depressing oh we have two that's nice can we actually check and see if we can eat these truffles and stuff nah it's not gonna let me eat uh we can eat it once we get out of here let's just look for like the smallest one which i'm assuming this one looks really really small so now let's see, it needs at least three hits. Yeah, we can make it. Three hits. And then, oh, it gave us two pieces of lumber once again. We're, we're getting lucky. How oh, awesome. I wonder how much money we're gonna earn from this. This is the most we've had so far. And I think this is only the third time we've worked for Woody because the first time you guys was the very, very first time that we worked and then, um. The second time that we worked for Woody, I wasn't able to record it. That was the time when I screwed up the friggin' recording. Okay, let's eat that. And, oh, I think our inventory is full, actually. Let's go ahead and eat this other baby truffle. Gives us a little bit of oomph uh, for the day. And it doesn't look like we, we have anything else to do other than... Because Wallace, I'm pretty sure, is also closed today. So, I'm not even gonna try looking for him. We haven't given anything to Gina, and to Martha, and who else? And to Wallace, and to Parsley, and t and Timmy. Uh, but I do want to offer something to the goddess, so let's go ahead and hurry up here. Offer something to her. Apparently the harvest goddess's name is Marina, which is such a cute name by the way. Okay, let's go ahead and give her a blueberry. 
I, and I'm sure it's too late. Ah, uh, it's too late of, ma to make a wish for today. Both guys and girls seem to think that looks are pretty important, right? I think that's ridiculous, but a person's face does display their what's in their heart. It tells you that how that person thinks, how that person has lived their life, and what kind of person they are. Not to mention how you feel towards me. A face can tell you a lot about a person. Girls can read guys' faces really easily. You better watch out. Okay, interesting. Uh, I, I actually agree with her. Good afternoon, and... What's wrong? You don't look really well. Let's actually give Chester something. Let's see if we can unlock uh, his path. And I totally forgot to sell stuff at the grocery, so... We might have to do that tomorrow. Ugh. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I actually agree with the goddess when she says that a person's face tells you a lot because you know you can really see from a person's expression whether they like you or not or i don't know and you know you can also see whether a person is clean or something you know if she said like you can tell by a person's face how they live their life and i totally agree with that because you know when a person is taking care of themselves you can see it in their face they look clean they take care of their teeth oh my god don't even get me started on teeth care like i'm kind of i don't know i'm not i'm not exactly obsessed but i think filipinos in general the people from the philippines uh value taking care of teeth like very very important oh we can come in interesting hmm this is actually my first time here at night. This is quite interesting. Let's go. Hey, are you all done with work? Good night, Leo. And let's just give him uh, a red herb, I guess. It's actually my... And I threw it away. What a waste. Actually, I think I can give him an egg instead. That's a really cute song. Unfortunately, my game's like <laughs> ruining it for you guys. Once again, apologies for the audio. I always apologize for the audio in every part. Uh, but yeah, sorry, sorry. Nothing we can do about it. I promise I did everything I can. Let's say hi to Parsley. Uh, you know what? Since he's here, let's go ahead and say hi. And give him a, a green herb. Where's the green herb? takes us for now it takes us forever to like roll through like there we go yay okay he really likes getting herbs from us so that's reassuring he's one of the cheapest persons to give gifts to so that's quite great we also need to plant our seeds i totally forgot let's eat these uh how many do we need to eat? And I think we can- we have an apple with us as well. I think that's gonna help us out with uh, our stamina and stuff. Hopefully it's gonna help us a little bit more. I wonder how much money we have. We have 1170. You know what? It's not so bad. We did some really decent work as well. I really, really want to get started on planting though, so... I guess I can plant half the carrots. I'm, I'm not even sure if I'm gonna able I'm gonna be able to till that many plots But anyway, let's just try and see let's go ahead and check this out what we can do Let's go ahead and use our hoe And we haven't even planted our alfalfas yet. So or alpha alpha. I don't know what you would call it So this is where the tomatoes are gonna. Be, I mean the potatoes are gonna be and then I think that's our last breath of strength here. We have an apple and we have an orange which we can eat. Very, very handy in emergency situations like this one. Let's go ahead and eat that. It did give us a very, very small amount of strength. So let's go ahead and eat an orange. I could have sworn. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully these help a little bit. Please let me till four lots of soil at least. Now I think it's gonna let me till just that many. Nothing else. Okay, you know what? Tomorrow's gonna be a sunny day. I'd rather just uh, go ahead and plant our carrots. 
because uh, they these are the most practical choice that we have as of now because they are gonna sell for quite a lot of money so that's great I hope the day after tomorrow isn't gonna be rainy cuz yeah probably gonna die if it rains like I mean the plants are definitely gonna die let's see and Let's check and see how our dog is doing. Indigo is doing really well. Actually, one more thing that I want to do that I've not talked about that much to you guys is actually grow some... I want to grow some mushrooms over here. You guys can see that there's like a bench over here that we can stockpile with a bunch of logs. Uh, examine it. It's dark and damp here. If you left lumber here, they would probably get covered with mushrooms. Yes, we need to leave a bunch of lumber. And then if we water them, uh, place that there. Is that enough? Oh, we can leave four pieces of lumber. I, I see, I see. Okay, let's just leave it there and pretend like something will sprout out. But anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and call it a day. Fingers crossed for tomorrow's weather. I really really hope that we do get some good weather for tomorrow. If not Probably gonna go crazy, but whatever. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and call it a day and just send our guy to sleep